Yeah. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. This is the left side of the pelvis. This is the ilium. This is the this part is the ischium and the medial half is the pubis. So we'll do the ilium first. Ilium. This is the anterior view, you know, by seeing the acetabulum has it connect to the hip. So here on the anterior side, we have the anterior superior iliac spine. Underneath it is the anterior inferior iliac spine. This covering over the wing is called the ilium crest. crest. And then this depression is called the iliac fossa. And we'll posteriorly. Same concept. This protrusion is called the posterior superior iliac spine. This one is the posterior inferior iliac spine. And then, okay. then we'll just go posteriorly. This indentation is called the greater sciatic notch. And then we went over this, but this is the ischi ischial spine, and this is the lesser sciatic notch. Okay. Okay, we'll go to the pubis now. So as I said earlier, this half from this opening, the, this opening is called the obturator foramen. So the medial half, this part, is the pubis. So the pubis has this covering here called the pubic crest. This protrusion here is called the pubic tubercle. This flattened edge is called the superior ramus of the pubis. This here, there you go, really medially, is the surface of the pubic symphysis. And then, yes, this edge. So remember this part was called the ramus also of the ischium. Remember this half, half of this, this part up to here is called the inferior ramus of the pubis. That's it.